So. Donald Trump pardons Jack Johnson. Wait. Wait a fucking minute. What? What's this? Fuck's this shit. Is that Wilder? Yeah, yeah, it's Deontay Wilder, so the fuck what? Now. Shout out to Ramiro Gomez and David Lopez on this. And let's start again. Donald Trump pardons Jack Johnson. And you know. Respect to the brothers who kept the shit real with the situation. Oh my Trump is so bad. It's a trick y'all. Photo op. Trump's a liar. Timer make a video pointing out how dumb y'all's motherfuckers are. Or. Maybe. Just maybe. The pardon was real and simply pure of heart. What? Motherfuckers who grab the pussy can't do nothing pure of heart huh? Is that it? Because everyone here in this is only here in it to the yo daddy grab in the pussy. No no it was mommy so it was different yeah yeah whatever. But the black man who faced this unjust racism. Was pardoned by the so called racist. Ironic huh? Or maybe. Just maybe it's what we told y'all was the deal all along. I mean we kicked the same shit from a jump. Yeah yeah y'all know it too. But hey. Everyone acts like they know their shit. They know. You got one problem. We're the ones that's been right so far. But what about when he blah blah? Blah blah what? Blah blah like every other president which you never flapped about because Hillary didn't give you fucking permission. Yeah yeah but Trumpy lied about the lunch bag deal yeah yeah whatever. That motherfucker's doing nothing no other president didn't do. He just doing better and made your fucking checks larger. Either you're a fraud that won't admit it. Or know nothing about what's happening. Which in either case you're not worthy of flapping. You got guys always talking crap. Some's claiming this really means nothing. Yeah well the other presidents including the brother didn't do this so called nothing. It means nothing that's why you talking about it. So once again. Respect to all who kept it real you're appreciated. Because none of those other presidents did it. The so called racist did. Why is he racists? Because the racist Hillary said so to win an election. And still loss. Once again. As we said from a fucking jump. Never strip naked and disarm your fucking selves. Yet some of these worthless coons still talking shit while Agent Kunin. Nevertheless. Shout out to Deontay Wilder. For standing the fuck up and doing the right thing for the sake of history. Our respect for Wilder's blown up to a whole nutta level. You know what we respect. A man who'll do the right thing in spite of what the brainless fucking minions will say. Who'll stand against the odds. Because you can betcha ass Wilder knew the chances of fans opposing the shit. You see, I knew I was gonna get some heat for this. And you did a fucking right thing. You've been one of the foundations to recognize an wrong and we respect it. And respect to all us sisters and brothers that's waking up. Because there's a lot. Some still not speaking out yet but we've got a lot of stomping grounds and we've heard from a lot of them. But buss it. You know how you train a dog. Give it love and treats when it does the right thing. Soon it'll learn when it does the right things. It gets positive results. It'll roll over sit stand jump and do all kind of shit you never dreamed. And it'll learn. Good things. Equal good results. Bad things. Equal bad results. Same goes for fucking presidents. But there's these dummies that never wanna admit when a man does a decent thing. All they do's bash. So we gotta give props to the brothers that kept it real. See the biggest problem with motherfuckers these days is not being their own man. Even on YouTube. Too many load to impress motherfuckers. Rather than just being who the fuck you are and freely doing so. And we love Jack Johnson for that same reason. The man was gonna be who the fuck he was and if you didn't like it too fucking bad. And now we got a newfound respect for Wilder for doing the same. Anna Gomez. No doubt he was the original player in a fight game. And we're gonna talk some Johnson in our throwback video. But we did a video on HBO and racism long ago. Long before all a racial talk. Was 10 players. Don't worry all the brave souls won't remember. However we got archives. Johnson was one of the ones we spoke on concerning racist calling this man a fucking coward. Sick shit. And they was calling us racists for calling the racists racists for being racist against Jack Johnson. We even had a few Kunin brothers claiming we was hella racist against white people. That's how dumb some of these motherfuckers was. Bravest motherfucker we ever seen in boxing. Walk through crowds of thousands of whites. 
to knock a white man out. In a fucking days when lynching was rampant. Solo dolo too and they call an um a coward. What a fucking joke. He opened gates no one would Darren had his own fucking mind no matter what anyone said of any race. Jack Johnson did Jack Johnson. Lip free no matter what. So Deontay Wilder did a great fucking thing. And we don't use the word great often. But he did Deontay Wilder no matter what a fuck would be said and that's a real motherfucker. Don't mean he love Trump now or none of this shit. Though we wouldn't care if he did. Like we don't hate Trump because Hillary said so. When he does something solid we can actually confirms racists. With factual proof. Then we'll slam the man. And admit he's racist. A racist we're still keeping in over Hillary. Because he respects our rights to defend ourselves against him with weapons and she don't. He's saying if I'm racist and lead in a corrupt government against you shoot at us. She's saying if I'm racist and lead in a corrupt government against you I'm not letting you have guns and you better die. Like wake a fuck up. So. We're still not putting no fucking Hillary bitch in a office and giving up our guns so get a fuck over it. And yes we keep that shit y'all feel there's no need to have. But you don't like it? So. So what? Yeah. Because the system purposely issued guns and nuts to kill so they can have a reason to take yours. Shit. We never give up our guns when there's mass shootings. We go buy more. We're like. There was a shooting. Cool new guns for everyone my treat. Yeah. We gotta protect ourselves against those mass shooters they keep purposely giving guns to. Yeah we know. Always some faggot talking about how we don't need that. How a whittle BB gun'll do. Yeah you keep your BB gun and we'll keep our military grade weapons. And if anyone don't like it too bad go jump off a fucking cliff. And for those who don't know why we're talking this political shit because we know some slow. It's because some's trying to insinuate Wilder somehow sold out over some claim some racist slick bitch made a win a campaign. Oh yeah Hillary likes hot sauce and knows Jay-Z all of a sudden when she's running. Why the fuck didn't she know these people before that? Because when it comes to all these black fighters and rappers Trump sure the fuck did. And years before. As for Wilder. And what Wilder did. Shit was great. He met with President Trump. And perhaps he got a little deeper insight on a big picture with all of this shit. Because Hillary sure the fuck wasn't pardoning diddly fucking squat. What's that mean? It means he met with the guys Hillary told these coons was a racist and did what needed to be done. And proved a bunch of duped suck is wrong. He went to the motherfucker with the power face to face. That's what a fuck leaders do. They don't sit back and complain. Like what a fuck motherfuckers expect them to do to make it happen. Meet with a fucking cab driver or something. These guys didn't comply with Trump Trump complied with them. For a mutually beneficial reason. They didn't brag about Trump's achievements Trump bragged about theirs. But we're gonna get a this Trump racist thing and wilder. In another video. Because some of y'all be cracking us up. But the pardon was a great thing. Jack Johnson needs no fucking pardon where he is. These motherfuckers never had no power over Johnson's soul. Yet it matters. Ironically for that very reason. Because it's a symbol. They can do nothing for Jack Johnson's soul and never could. Because they never had that power. The man's not even alive. Wilders played a part in this statement and awakening awareness for us people. Start walking on earth with that state of mind. And it's the most powerful message ever. Wilders engaged in a bigger historical meaning and message than the blind and ignorant know. It's an acknowledgement. It's not a story for no fucking reason. History's gotta change and tell the story of a man wronged now. What Trump just did which Wilder and Lewis deserve respect for is having a man take a knee. And not a football type knee. Wilder didn't take a fucking knee. The system did for him. And a future will be different now due to this. Which Wilder assisted in making it happen. On a political level. Wilder making sure what Johnson went through wasn't in veins big. Destroying paper and writing it in a stone that can't be. Oh buddy didn't do blah 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 give it a rest. He did something for history. For his people. And for a woman whose heart this shit meant something to. And he got it and saw the bigger picture and sacrificed. I'll do this shit for ya. No matter what the crowd says. Much respect to Wilder. We gotcha back on this. Betcha ass on that. Doesn't mean we'll agree with everything Wilder does. Nor Trump. We might be slamming both them motherfuckers tomorrow. But today we gotcha back. We're only on one side. The righteous side. 
Do the right thing. We gotcha. Don't do the right thing. And we don't. No matter who the fuck you are. And we got wilder on this. Which no others achieved. Coming together with Stallone Lewis and Linda Haywood. We're seriously impressed with Wilder. See these athletes flapping cause strife while complaining. If Wild roll meet a motherfucker and make shit happen. In this situation anyway. But if anyone has a problem with me supporting Jack Johnson and his partner, standing strongly behind his family, supporting Linda Haywood, his great niece, and the shake of Trump hands for signing the pardoning, come and see me. I'm not hard to find. I'm 6'7", so I can't hide. Come and see me. Not through violence, but understanding and reasoning. That's big. And that says something to us. He's saying no matter who the fuck you are. Friend or foe. Step a fuck up. We honestly never expected it. Now that's a real motherfucker. We just figured Wilder would be like the rest of the clowns that flap and get nut and done other than complaining. That's a sacrifice and fighters like Wilder knows what Johnson dealt with. With this situation anyway. And if Trump's a racist then Wilder must really be a bad motherfucker if he got a racist making moves to uplift black people and openly say America was wrong. Fuck's Wilder a magician or something. I'm taking this very righteous step, I believe, to correct a wrong that occurred in our history and to honor a truly legendary boxing champion. That's deep. What's funny the Hillary Coon still Coonan. Don't ever meet the president. That's their philosophy. Yeah they suggest waiting for four or eight years before making another move because Hillary told him Trump was racist. Don't even know if it's true Hillary told him so sweet gotta be in their agent Coonan minds. So let's get this straight. Trump. Who's asked to meet with more black leaders than any president we've ever seen. Is racist because Hillary whose mentor is a clan leader said so. The Democratic Party preys on you not having your own minds. While faking like they're for minorities. Well Wilder only proved he does. And we gotta respect it. We meet with friends and enemies on a regular. Even you Christians Jesus met the devil. You know. The devil that controls your fucking minds. Meetings normal for masters of themselves. See these clowns are evil jokes. Vacha achieving. No seriously. Answer that question. How about we answer it? Absolutely nothing. But Wilder has. He didn't do what he did for Trump, he did what he did for us people. Some may not know this or may try and downplay it. But it's a piece of power that can be utilized by anyone on a righteous side. Anyone any race. Respect to Wilder for help and establish it. How's this power used? That one's for the deeper minds. We wouldn't even cast those pearls before layman swine. Respect to the real players listening. Unfortunately there's always a certain amount of swine listening too. So do Ramiro Gomez and David Lopez. That's how we see it. We respect if you disagree. Your views are certainly welcome. But for us it was a great thing. We respect everyone's freedom so long as they not trying to control motherfuckers. However much respect a y'all no matter. Oh. Also. There's some extreme Wilder fans getting a little backlash over this shit. Well we respect those channels who came a Wilder's defense. Naturally you gotta understand though. If you've been one of those arrogant types always initiating snapping on motherfuckers. And we said initiating not defending. There's a difference. But if you've been one of those types. It's natural for a little backlash. See your followers and minions may forget what you do. Even two minutes after you did it. They're addicts with no choice. They burned every bridge following your example so got nothing left once you're gone. That's a pretty worthless following. And we're not trying to crack on anyone. Y'all's all our brothers and sisters like us or not. We're just saying. Everyone's worth more than that elusive shit that bites y'all in a ass in a end. Hey. We're not exempt. But just because mindless addicts forget what you do. To get another hit and fix. Doesn't mean your enemies do too. So we're not hating on either. Those dish in a backlash or those defending against it? That's just mirror mirror shit. We've got none of those problems because we keep it honest from a jump. Though we all get trolls. So we get it. But we told y'all straight up how we felt about Trump Hillary our guns microchipping and all that crap. So we don't gotta submit her flip flop. 
and no this ain't directed towards no community. Motherfuckers be getting way too arrogant with that shit. Oh you say and it's cause you saw my video no we didn't see a fucking video. If the shoe fits it simply fits. However we personally respect anyone support in Wilder on this one. Anyone any community, betcha ass on that. Yet we'll speak more on this racism game on a later date. Because there's a right time for everything. And until then. Peace. We're out.